Boys and girls, cats and squirrels, welcome back to the Plants vs. Zombies podcast, and we're keeping on, keeping on in the pool world, and let's talk about what was happening for me this week, and just all around the sports world and everything just in general, so if you guys enjoy, make sure to like, sub, leave a comment down below, and as always, don't forget to be a goat, and let's get into it, so starting off with week one of basketball really is kind of the biggest thing for me it started it's happening basketball is back and i cannot be more excited i had not been a basketball fan until probably about two two three years ago when the bucks won the finals which you could call me a bandwagon fi- fan fine i don't care i don't i'm not saying you're wrong i am Probably the most bandwagon fan you'll find out there right now, but I just enjoy watching basketball ever since Basically, they won the finals. It doesn't matter who's playing. I just enjoy watching it So it's been really fun to see you know the Clippers play with Kawhi and PG and the new Suns You know with just Beal not being out but then Booker game one and then him not getting out. It's just everyone is just not healthy, but healthy, and everything's, like, good. Like, Giannis and Dame, it's so it's so much fun to watch right now. Everything's just so entertaining to me, which is good, because that's what I want, so. Yeah, week one of the NBA is in full effect, and the Bucks play their second game of the season today, as I'm recording. Sorry, excuse me real quick. My gunk in my throat because I'm still a little sick, but yeah, the NBA season is starting to get into full swing, so can't wait to watch the Bucks tonight as well as the Packers to play today because they play today against the Vikings, and I have a really, really terrible feeling about that game as in we're going to get our booties eaten up, like absolutely destroyed. The Packers ain't going to do jack in that game. I guarantee you we are going to go. It's going to be like 50 to nothing. We might get blown out worse than the Broncos did against the literal Dolphins 70-20. Like it might be worse than that. I ain't going to lie. It's going to be a bad, bad game for us, I think. I'm just hoping that it's not terrible. As in like the worst blowout of all time type terrible. All right, so in other news, with sports out the way, I finished my taxidermy on my fish. It's in my basement right now. I might throw up a picture of it just for y'all, but I mean, I don't think it's going to smell good after a couple weeks because we didn't really do any preservative type of stuff to it. It was just kind of huck it in, you know, and just... Make it work, and I, I don't think that's a good thing. But maybe it'll work. Maybe. I don't really care too much, though, because I'm proud of what I did. It's that simple. I'm proud of what I did, and I, I'm going to move on with my life. Uh, and then the rest of school this week. I missed, like, one day, I think, because... I think, Yeah, I missed Tuesday this week, just because I, I wasn't feeling it, man. I've been having some, like, just struggles in general, we'll say. Just due to, like, just a lot of stress on my plate. Trying to get out the videos and everything and trying to be on top of everything. It's just, it's just kind of a little too much at times, which is kind of to be expected, seeing as I'm trying to daily upload, which is not the most wise thing in my opinion to do but it's not terrible i enjoy doing it so that's why i'm doing it if i didn't enjoy daily uploading i wouldn't do it i i know enough about how it works to say i'm not gonna be a dumb head and instead just move on with my life if i can't daily upload and just move on to you know every couple days or every other day or whatever works for me i will make that happen i will not just go afk on y'all though because we did just hit 200 subscribers which is the big news of the week really in my opinion 200
100 subs. Absolutely ridiculous, man. Can't believe it. Thank you guys so much for the love and support. Just as of late, it's been, like, insane with all the Clash of Clans videos. They're just going off. And everything in general. It's just, it's been so much fun to just do these videos. And just talk. Do a camera. Play some games. Interact with you guys in the comments and everything. It's just great. It's just great. I cannot tell you how much of a, like, dream life feels like right now. Just with everything going on. It feels so great. I, I wish everyone could feel how free I feel. Because genuinely, I feel like nothing can stop me. You know, like that type of thing. Like, I just feel so free and so happy. That's great. So I hope you guys can find something that brings you that type of happiness, too. Because genuinely, it's the greatest feeling in the world. And then we're going to go on to Mario Wonder. I finally got to play it yesterday. And dang, the game just feel or the day before, but like, the game just feels so nice. Oh my gosh, the game, it's just beautiful. It's just beautiful. I can't say enough about it. I'm going to rave about it for months on end. It's not perfect. No, no game is perfect. I don't expect a perfect game off launch. But it's so much fun. It's so much fun. And I cannot say enough how good that animation style works with Mario. I, I don't know why, it just does. It's really fun. I've also been able to stay off the spoilers for Spider-Man 2. And, you know, I was off the spoilers for Mario Wonder before it came out. So I'm really happy right now with where I'm at gaming-wise. Especially because in four days, three days, there's the MW3 campaign early access, which I will be streaming for you guys the day of it coming out after I get home from school. Hopefully I can finish it all. I don't know if I will be able to. But we'll figure it out. Don't worry. I am not going to just give up all hope of that or streaming. Yep. Then another game here. We got to Clash of Clans. The Clash of Clans clan games for this month have ended. And we're about to get into CWL in about two days, I think. Season's about to end. I have my second account, or I have my Tunnel 13 rushed alt at already 350k Sour Elixir. I might have to grind on my Tunnel 11, though, to get that. And I'm not quite done with all my um, Sour Elixir on that Tunnel 14 account, but or Tunnel 13 account. That's rush. But I am working on it. I think the last day of the event, I'm going to put out a video for y'all just, just, like, claiming everything I can and doing a huge spree, hopefully, on my Town Hall 13, the rush space. Because I think I'm going to be able to just absolutely just go crazy with it. So, hopefully, that does happen. I don't know if it will, but I hope it does. But it's been really fun to just chill on Clash, because Clash is a game I played for eight years now, and Clash Royale... The other Clash game, I played for 7, which is how long it's been out. I haven't, down to the day, played it. Every day it's been out, or like, anything like that. But it, I've I've been around Clash Clans for a long, long time. And I, I'm not very old myself, so I'd say I'm wise in my years with how much Clash knowledge I have. Yeah, it's, it's kind of a problem at times, but I haven't spent that much on it. Only in the past year have I actually spent money on the game. But, you know, I, I just can't let it go too far. Unless it's a business or something, I don't know. But we're working towards 500 subs where I can now get monetized because, you know, it's cool. Like I was saying, I now can get monetized at 500 subs rather than 1,000. It's only the watch hours, but whatever. My sweet oily bacon. A thousand coins a slice. All over the place. Ooh, eight slots. This is definitely what we're getting. And we're gonna buy pool cleaners. And eventually we'll be able to get... Gatling pea and twin sunflower. But... And nine plants, even. Not that important to me, though. 
I wish I wouldn't have had to spend 10k on this because I think they made me right. That's disappointing. Uh, we're getting to a place where I just kind of want to maybe say a little bit more. And then, like I was saying, this is a conveyor belt run, so we're gonna. Jeez, I feel congested. But I feel like we can just run through this one real quick. Oh, there's the things we just got. The pool cleaners. I don't know how much more I got to say, but, okay, I wasn't sure if that was the bullying one or what, but I guess, guess we're just doing that there. Uh, caffeine, that's about it. I have that big cup of caffeine literally every day, I think, at this point. It's probably a issue, but we don't talk about that. Because caffeine makes the world go round. Yeah. I'll just quick talk about how the gym been going. Um, I hit legs yesterday. Hit um, 200 for four, which ain't that bad, in my opinion. I ain't that strong yet, but I'm getting there. I'm getting there for sure. I'm proud of where I came from. I'll have to make a video on that someday, but I mean, yeah, I am. I'm proud of where I came from. You guys may never understand if I don't make a video on that, so I'm gonna have to. I'll pre I, I'm i planning on making like a video at some point in time, just kind of explaining who I am, what I do type of thing. For like a YouTube like, um, like channel trailer type of thing. But then again, I don't know. When I'm gonna do that, that is, wait, I, I don't know when I, I'm gonna get around to that. Cause I don't want to replace a daily upload with that, but like, I'm gonna have to. Which is perfectly okay, in my opinion. Ugh, jeez, I feel terrible. Oh, we carved pumpkins last night. That's another fun thing, cause it's about to be spooky season's final day. Although it did snow outside, so I was just peeking to see if the snow stayed. But it did snow yesterday for us, where I'm at, so. I mean, spooky season is spooky season is well on its way out. Like well on its way out. I'm okay with that though. Spooky season isn't my favorite season. My favorite season is Christmas. Christmas, baby, let go. Christmas. I love Christmas. Christmas is so much fun. Like genuinely, I just love it. It's there's something so magical about Christmas to me. Like just the just the general season. It's just so insane. It's just, bro, I'm almost tearing up over it. it. I love Christmas so much. I love it. Oh my gosh. There is just something about Christmas I will never be able to explain to people that just makes me feel just, just, I don't, I don't know. Just, it makes it feel special. Truly. And then we got New Year's after that. So like, we ain't even that far off, like, really fun stuff. Because then, jeez, the year's flying by, I'll tell you that much. But, I mean, the years go by and we get older. We gotta learn to live with that, you know? Jeez. My sister, who's only, you know, a little older than me, is just, just the ages of me and my family just feels so weird. It feels like we should be younger than we are, but just everything's going so fast, you know? Time flies. And I'm okay with it. Because, you know, I'm having fun. And I hope you guys are too. So. Yeah, I made my pumpkin into a little bit of just, you know, like a, just a normal face. So. That's where we're ending it. That's where we will end it today. We're getting closer and closer to the end of this game, and then we will be on to PVZ2, which, personally, don't get me wrong, I love Plants vs. Zombies, the original, but Plants vs. Zombies 2 is my cup of tea, comparatively. I beat it once only, all the way through, but I've played a lot of it. It's kind of like Geometry Dash. i played a lot of it, haven't ever, like, beat it. But I finally did beat it this past year, so we will be doing it again here I didn't put any videos out on it last year, but I will put them out this year. So if you guys enjoyed, please like, sub, leave a comment down below. 
And as always, don't forget to be a goat and join me on my, you know, climb of the YouTube mountain. So, thanks so much for watching and the love and support recently. And uh, hopefully, these stupid ads won't interfere as much with my outros. Peace.